The first step is collecting all of your dry pieces of clay. It's important that they're dry so that the clay will easily absorb the water. Mix it to a milk-like consistency. Strain it through your sieve to get out all the rocks and sticks. Leave it to sit overnight and sponge off the water that rose to the top. I draped a cotton pillowcase around the bucket and then poured in my mixture. Tie it on your bucket overnight to let the excess water drip out. It's been about 24 hours later and it's time to dump this clay on a cotton bed sheet. This part can be very messy, and why I wore white, I managed to get zero clay on my outfit. So here I am scraping it off of the front of the pillowcase, and then I'll flip it over and scrape the other side. You want to leave this to dry for a few hours. I ended up leaving mine a little bit too long, so I spritzed it with a bit of water. It turned out to be this beautiful chocolatey brown color. I'll wrap it in plastic for a few hours before throwing it on the wheel to make some test tiles. In part three, we will be dry processing instead of wet, so stay tuned.